For marijuana, Grow House was auctioned off this afternoon in the Poconos. The bidding process was intense, but it was done for a good cause. The sale allows investigators to continue fighting the war on drugs. Eyewitness News reporter Brianna Strunk first showed us the property two weeks ago, and tonight she brings us the update. 61. Have 60,000, 61, but we 61. 61, 61, 61. It was an intense few minutes as the bids crept higher and higher. Nine people were vying for this four acre property off Wooddale Drive in Stroud Township. And we had quite the bidding war for a little bit. This couple from Marshalls Creek wanted to flip the house and held on until their final bid of 65 grand. Is there any advance on $65,000? You got to set up a limit and not go over it. You don't get caught up in, you know, the action. In the end, Manuel Pagué placed the highest bid of $67,000. The construction worker from Newark, New Jersey, hasn't decided what he'll do with the property. I'm going to try to fix it first. Then I'm going to see what happened with that. If my family want to move or, or selling, or I'm not sure yet. State police say a man from Philadelphia owns the house and used it to grow large amounts of marijuana. The property was forfeited to Monroe County's Drug Task Force, which benefits from this sale. So that'll certainly go to fight the war on drugs and help officers with overtime, any new equipment that we might need or training that can help us better ourselves and be one step ahead of the next criminal. The property was sold as is, although a professional cleaning company did remove large tubs of water, plywood platforms, exhaust fans, and other drug paraphernalia. It has potential. In Stroud Township, Brianna Strunk. Eyewitness News.